Hi, you guys. This is Prophetess Ophelia Sabrina Acapo and wanted to bring you a quick prophetic word that the Holy Spirit spoke into my spirit on today. And as with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. Holy Spirit, I invite you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. I decrease as you increase. Allow me to bring forth your word, with your glory, with your power, with your grace, with your mercy. Telling your story so your name can be glorified for the winning of souls to the gospel of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's mighty name that I do pray. Amen, 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 amen. Tidy, you guys, of this prophetic word is by any means necessary. I'm adding additions. By any means necessary, I'm adding additions. And so, you guys, I'm around at the laundromat and I let, I wait for hours and the clothes still not dry. But I had a second dryer. And the Lord said, go back to the car and get the quarters because you still got time left on that one. <laughs> God is just so amazing. And so I fastly, hurriedly got all the clothes out of the dryer where they didn't dry and added them to the dryer to where I had more time on it to add more quarters to it. And then the Lord gave me the revelation, started speaking and auctioning into my spirit. He said, that had been what I'm doing for you by enemies necessary. I'm adding additions to your life as you're adding those quarters to the machine. I'm adding additions to your life. I'm giving you double for your trouble. The Lord has said in Ephesians 3 and 20 and exceedingly abundantly above all that you could ever ask or think according to the power. That is at work on the inside of you. The Lord is saying, think about the principles and practicalities of this thing and definitely connect by faith, activate by the grace and mercy, the glory and power of God because the Lord is doing something spectacular here. The Lord is doing something huge here. The Lord wants you to know that it is happening now. The Lord is wanting you to know that you are about to take off and exhaust. It's not going to be a small thing. The Lord is saying what he's doing. It wasn't even about the washer and the change. The Lord has said, I'm changing you. I'm adding additions to you, my chosen few, my chosen remnant. He said, because you chose to seek me first, the kingdom of God and his righteousness, all these things are being added on to you. There are not going to be any more takeaways, but the Lord is putting you in settlement in this month of June. And the Lord is saying those settlements are here to stay and are here. Jesus, 1 Peter 5 and 10, that he is restoring you, confirming you, establishing you, strengthening you right now, and he is settling you by any means necessary, whatever it takes. Once again, there will be no more takeaways. There will be no more mistakes. God has put his hands in this. God has put his hands on you. He's going to see you through. You're going to shine through to the light of his glory. This is that dawning of a brand new day. This is the hour and you have reached that level. You have reached that plateau and you have entered that promotional position of power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You guys, I am feeling this thing right here because I am telling you definitely Claim this word over your life. Do not take this word for granted. Because your breakthrough, your manifestations, your blessings, your miracles, your birthrights, your inheritances have landed. The Lord has said by any means necessary, I'm adding it to you. I'm going to give it to you. Nobody's going to be able to stop it. At this point, I see parachutes. I'm dropping it now. I'm dropping it now in your life. When you least expect it, I'm going to do what's necessary. I'm going to add additions to your life. You will not be without any more. But the Lord has said you have reached your end time season, your new month of more. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Don't forget to hit that noti bell where you guys can be notified each time I upload a video. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that this word, once again, 
I pray that this word, excuse me, you guys, has given you revelation. And the, this word has given you understanding of what I'm saying. Let it edify, exhort, and exalt your life in such a phenomenal way by the special grace of God. Because not only do the, does the Lord want to add, I'm so full, you guys, additions to your life. The Lord wants to add greatness to your life. The Lord is one to add that newness to your life. I hear 2 Corinthians 5 and 17 that when you are in Christ, you are a new creation of old things have passed away. The Lord has said, behold, I am doing a new thing. Now it shall spring forth. Now it shall spring forth. Now it shall spring forth. Now it shall spring forth as pure gold. You will walk through the fire. And you came out as pure gold. And you're about to live your life. The Lord has said by any means necessary if I have to go around all four corners of the earth in the spirit as well as in the physical realm. I am going to place my hands on it. I'm going to place my hands on you. I'm going to add plurals. I'm going to add additions. I'm going to see you through shining in the light of my glory to tell your story. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh, you guys. You're about to take off. This thing is going to be on fire. By any means necessary. I'm adding to your life. No more takeaways. It is here to stay. It's here to be continuous. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you,